EDUCAST WJEC specification asks us to consider ethical egoism as an agent-focused ethic based on self-interest as opposed to altruism. This film will consider the general concept of ethical egoism according to the specification and the contribution of Max Stirner. The challenges to egoism will be covered in later films. Ethical egoism is an agent-focused ethic, so it says that the right moral act is an act that is done because the end product is beneficial to the agent. Meta-ethically, then, it defines a good or right act as being one that is performed in the agent's own self-interest. Normatively, this means that if I am faced with a choice about whether to lie, for example, I should not be concerned with the intrinsic goodness of the act itself. Instead, I am to be concerned with whether or not lying would serve my own interests at this moment or in the future. Altruism is acting in the interests of other people rather than ourselves. Ethical egoism argues that we should not sacrifice our own interests to act in the interests of other people. Psychological egoism is not a normative ethical theory. It is descriptive and simply describes the motives of the agent. Psychological egoism is not concerned with what we ought to do or what we should do. It is only concerned with what we do do. Psychological egoism says that the psychological state of the human brain is such that when I make ethical decisions, I will always act in my own self-interest rather than the interests of others. Therefore, even if I think I'm acting altruistically, I am not. My actions are always concerned with serving me and my own wants or needs. In season five, episode four of Friends, Phoebe and Joey have an argument about this very topic. Is there any such thing as a selfless good deed? If, like Phoebe, I act as a surrogate mother, am I doing it for the benefit of the hopeful parents or am I doing it out of my own desire to be instrumental in causing a happy response? Ethical egoism is concerned with how I should behave and therefore would argue I should do what benefits me. Ethical egoism does not necessarily agree that we actually do always act in our own self-interest, only that we ought to.